Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, today we're gonna get a bunch of maintenance done on the XB. Tire rotation, oil change, air filter done, and the cabin filter all taken care of. I'm gonna show you how I do it and what I think is the easiest method to taking care of it all. I'll leave all the products and everything below. Uh, that way you can pick up some of the things that you might need. All right guys, hang on tight. I have a body trim tool here impact with a 10 millimeter on it not necessary but it does help speed things up a wrench with a one inch socket and an adapter my oil filter and a breaker bar the black piece here is a hydro guard for the air filter and we have a screw on a funnel the cleaning supplies for the air filter and cabin filter in the oil now you can use ramps for the oil change um, but for the tire rotation you will need to jack and jack sands so I will utilize all at the same time. You should definitely get a pair of these energy gas trucks if you haven't gotten them yet. All right, I am now taking off the splash tray uh, to avoid oil collecting on it and getting everything else dirty. Here I am taking off the Mishimoto 1 inch magnetic oil drain plug. Perks of this is it collects any metal that might be in the oil and also has a reusable washer. Go ahead and clean, inspect for metal shavings, and reinstall. If you can't get the oil filter off by hand, uh, this oil filter does have a one inch nut on the bottom of it, so that's real convenient. Make sure you put oil in the actual filter before installing and put oil on the o-ring for a better seal. Make sure you clean the mating surface so the filter has a proper seal. With a screw on the funnel, this allows you to pour your oil much faster and avoid making a mess. So once you get done jacking a vehicle up, make sure you have a jack stand for safety. And looks like I have a screw in this tire, so that's not repairable. 
Since I have a cold air intake, I do have to take off the front tire to access the filter. The filter is off here and my wheel liner is toast. In the XB to access your cabin filter, take the glove box off. There is a little door right here and you take that off to access the filter. If you have an oiled air intake filter, you go ahead and apply oil after it's been cleaned. If you have a dry filter, you just reinstall. If you don't know what filter you have, check with the manufacturer. The cabin filter, after cleaning, go ahead and add a refresher to it. Make sure you also clean the hydro guard. When torquing down your lug nuts, make sure you go in a star pattern. I'm using a torque wrench here, and once it's torqued, I go ahead and double check it one more time. In most Toyotas, including the XB, go ahead and switch over to trip A on the odometer. You're gonna turn off the ignition, and when you're turning it back on, you're going to go ahead and hold the odometer button. This is what it will look like. There we go, guys. Well, thank you for watching today's video. Again, if you haven't subscribed, please consider it. I'm at goal to 500 subscribers for 2020. Um, and tomorrow is a quarantine and cruise. So if you want to find more info about that, go ahead and click my Instagram. I'll have a post there for you guys. But thanks again. I'll see you guys next week. Now